Hi guys, Brendan and Kieran here from the GAGK, um, along with Mike Lindsay from Studio 7 Fitness. Something a little bit different today, I suppose up till now we've been focusing on on the field exercises and drills that we can do to hopefully take our game to the next level. So today we're going to be focusing on some off the field stuff to help improve our mobility and flexibility to make that on field stuff a little bit easier. Um, delighted to say, as I said, we've got Mike with us today who's going to help take us through some of these exercises. So I think guys, let's get into it. Let's go. Okay, so the first group of exercises we're going to look at is working on our shoulders, which are very important um, for goalkeepers. You know, in the J, we're, we're, we're jumping and we're catching balls coming in, also obviously diving and, and, and kind of reaching and saving the ball obviously is, is important. So we're going to look at shoulder um, mobility first. The first exercise is called a T-band pullover. So these are TheraBands, you can get them in any um, sports shop really. Different resistances, but basically with this one, we're going to hold the band towards the end. Okay, we're not going to have any slack on the band, we want to keep the tension on. Okay, band's down here, and again, nice and steady, it's not too quick. We're going to bring the band above the head, and we're going to try and then bring the band over and down towards the glutes. At the same time, kind of bring it back. Now, if there's a restriction in the shoulder, obviously, if you have a problem, if you can only go as far as here, it's no problem, bring it back over. Okay, we'll see how the guy's getting on. Moving on to exercise number two for the, the shoulder, we're looking at, they're called nine to three pull aparts. Again, we're using the T-band. So we're looking at scapular control on this one. A lot of us tend to be caught up from various things, from jobs and things, or sitting, we tend to be a little bit rounded. So it's really good for bringing a um, little bit of movement in those <coughs> kind of mid traps um, and into the rhomboids, kind of into that kind of uh, shoulder blade area, okay? So the way we do this one, you're gonna bring your hands in a little bit closer. Um, you're gonna have your hands out in front of you. That's your starting position. So it's called a 9 to 3 pull apart because if you're looking on the clock face, that's where we're going to be pulling our hands. So you're going to pull your hands away from each other. You're going to look around, around kind of mid chest level. But well, we don't want to go too high because we don't want to get the upper traps involved, okay? Mid traps, you really want to squeeze. A good way I, I kind of tell clients here is think there's a two euro coin but between your shoulder blades and you want it to make it stick, okay? That's a little thing you can kind of think of. Squeeze that shoulder blades together, feel that pause for maybe uh, one to two seconds and then come back out. You can repeat that again, desired amount of times, 10, 15, um, and uh, try that one out. 